The group calling itself Islamic State has beheaded the American hostage Peter Kasig, according to claims in a video posted online. The film, which Euronews is not showing, features an apparent execution carried out by a masked man. The 26-year-old aid worker, a former soldier who changed his name to Abdul Rahman, devoted his time to helping Palestinian and Syrian refugees. He'd written to his parents, who'd pleaded directly to his captors to release him, saying that if he did die, people should take comfort in the fact he'd worked to alleviate suffering. Kasig was working for his own charity when he was captured in Syria in October last year. Washington says if the video is authentic, it would be appalled by the brutal murder of an innocent American. British Prime Minister David Cameron said the beheading again showed ISIL to be a depraved organisation.